What's going on, y'all? This is Cruz here at where we at the Analog right now. We at the Two Live Bree event, the release party, and we ran a, we ran across a couple artists right here, man. We got Chucky three times, and she loves Flacco. I thought he said shoot him up, Flacco. At first, I was like, I'm scared. We gotta get him out of here. I don't know. Real power, no violence. <laughs> Word. No violence. Real playing shit. We don't promote no violence. Word. Uh -huh. Now nah, that's love. So y'all are y'all are out here. What are y'all? What are y'all doing out here? What's your What's your purpose of being at the show tonight? Oh, uh, we here tonight. You know what I'm saying? Just to connect for real. You know okay. Build a build a little uh, a base, mm -hmm. a better base, a stronger base. Okay. Dope. And what yeah. about you? You on the same time? Oh, uh, we yeah, we on the same oh, yeah. thing. Yeah, yeah. yeah Which yeah, are y'all sure, on the same time? And this we do yeah. music together. Okay, y'all yeah. like a duo group. A duo. Duo, all that solo you know duo. We can do it all. Oh, that's yeah. fine. Y'all you know. based out of Nashville? No. Murfreesboro. Oh, that's fine. That's where I just drove from. Oh, yeah. Are you from the borough? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. MBT so for sure. Six one five. You did. <laughs> yeah. 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 Nah. I'm not. I'm from Pennsylvania. I just moved out here like 2020. But um, my fault. They the show is starting. I keep hearing it. The headphones is different from out there. But um, but so y'all y'all born and raised in Murfreesboro? Yeah, I'm born and raised in Murfreesboro. Okay. I'm from uh, New Albany, Mississippi, North Mississippi. Fire. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So what, what connected y'all? Did y'all go to school or something, or how did y'all know each other? Yeah, we went, to, we went to school. We grew up together, like, this is my oldest friend, bro. Like, oh, word? Second, first grade. Oh, word? Yeah, first grade. Oh, so locked in. in. That's Take fine. it back like Cadillac. Yeah, so you was in Mississippi when you was like... Man, I moved, I moved down here like five going on six. Oh, okay. Yeah, then I've been down here. Then I met him, what, first grade, second grade? Yeah, mm -hmm. like first grade. It was first grade. And was y'all always doing music when, like, or is this something that came later on? We were just always doing, sh really. We yeah. Were always doing stuff together, and you know, so pretty, pretty, pretty much like we always been like the, I guess like the entertainment. So shit. We yeah. Just, from there, we just started doing music type shit. We already doing shit anyway. Yeah. Bored, so we started doing this shit. Started taking it serious a couple years ago. Mm hmm. And did you guys see any like type of success or anything different that you're like, yo, we gotta keep doing this shit? Man, we did a little bit of everything, but shit, we just know now we just trying to come harder because like we did, well, we performed that limelight before they closed. We connected with like people around Nashville and did all that mixtape with certain DJs and all that. So we did a little bit of everything. So now we know what we really need to focus on, right? And marketing wise, and go harder on that. You feel That's what I'm fine. saying? And then just run with it. So yeah. Been doing a lot of, we did a lot, really. And being in Murfreesboro, do y'all feel like it's harder, like because it ain't really much in the, I'm a, in Murfreesboro? I'm gonna be real, Murfreesboro, Murfreesboro, damn near like a, a boiling pot, man. Because mm. half the Boy. people from Murfreesboro, not even from Murfreesboro, and we right 30 minutes from Nashville, yeah, three hours from Memphis. So you mm -hmm. see what's going on in Memphis, you see right. what's going on in the Ville, and Atlanta only three hours too. You did what I'm saying, so it's like. I feel like I feel like Murfreesboro damn near got only a couple years. I think we're gonna be the head honchos of that though. Like Yeah, nah, that's fine. So because Murfreesboro, I read is like the fastest growing city in America type shit. Yeah. Exactly, exactly. They trying to bring a lot of stuff there, you know, bring that business up and build it up. Like I just seen something about they trying to build a minor league baseball team in Murfreesboro. Oh, well, yeah, yeah, they yeah. To and they're making so a, a amphitheater of, in there too yeah. in Murfreesboro, like a so big it's ass. Coming, it's, it's growing, so it's gonna be like a Nashville, in it, but it's on self. You get yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah. So we like the underdog, but we finna come and you feel what I'm saying? So you y'all feel like um like when that. When it when Murphy's Bureau starts building up like that, y'all feel like y'all gonna be in a good position to be like, yo, this is we we one of the heads of Murphy's Bureau type shit. That that's exactly what we are. Okay. Not okay. even what we what's coming. That's what we know. are. You okay. Know ask around, ask about us. You, you, okay. You, they'll tell you. They'll tell you. You, you go you go to Murphy's Bureau. They know Chuck. Uh -huh. They know Kareem. She love. She love Flacco. Kareem and Dream. You know all that. You know what I'm yeah. So no, that's so hard. definitely, I feel like I feel like we definitely we gonna be in that position one. Already, we already making moves, mm -hmm. but it's, it's it's as far as once everybody catch on, we are already moving. So once they catch on, we right. You know what I'm saying? So so what's some what's some uh, albums or songs or videos y'all got out right now? So I'm gonna be real. This man, this man right here, most consistent. Yeah, I'm not even gonna lie to he you, said, bro. He, he ain't bullshitting. He got, he he got me beat. Yeah, and I'm, and I'm gonna say that, bro. He got some shit going. He just he just put out. Yeah. <laughs> Man, you know, I be doing a lot of things trying to stay active, you know, to just keep it, like, you know how social media is easy to get lost, but I just dropped a single called Oh Shit on all platforms. Okay. It's a, 
If you smoke, like smoke, vibes, positive uh -huh. vibes, check it out. It's okay. on all platforms. Fire. But been, been doing it a lot consistently with videos all on YouTube, all that shit. We got videos together on YouTube Dope. when we was a group going hard and strong when we first started out. Mm -hmm. But yeah, we, we yeah. And y'all get y'all record yourselves or y'all y'all got a home nah, studio? We, we, yeah. we, we started off we started off like that. Mm -hmm. Like he 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 got a laptop and, and started figuring all the things out and then from there you know what I'm saying? He got his own thing going on. And we, you know what I'm saying? We still shoot to a Della Studio type shit. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? To record. But for the most part, like, pretty much we use our own studio for rough drafts and we do go some rough exactly. like record. You know what I mean? Dope. So, so, so it, it really is homegrown. Mm -hmm. It really is homegrown. Nah, that's fire. Now I like that and that y'all stuck together. You know what I'm saying? Not a lot of people, you know. And make it through that Because it's a lot of things You go with, with being a duo group I had a, a, a guy I did it Because I make music too And I was with a guy We were a duo And then he wanted to go Play basketball overseas I was like Alright man <laughs> Like we invested Hella bread in this shit We traveling And you know what I'm saying But Yeah Consistency always key for real Yeah So it's good that y'all Locked in still Man that's why I said You know Because it's easy to lose focus And you know Us uh, Go away, go strip out. But if y'all come back together, you know it's always strong because the bond never, you know, lose. Right. So it's just all about, you know, staying true to who you are and then who y'all y'all know each other the best. So we really, yeah, y'all probably, you know, you and your uh, partner, y'all probably still got the same love today. Right. Exactly. But it's, but it's like it wasn't no level. music. You yeah. gotta respect what he doing. You feel right. me? Also, then you got your own thing going. Exactly. So y'all both. So you know, y'all can always come back and do something. You feel me? Yeah. Never. You feel me? So, so what's something that, you know, that separates y'all from other people? Everybody make music. What's something that separates y'all from everybody else doing music? Go ahead and start it off. I'll say first, first, first and foremost, I mean, hell, look, I mean, we don't, we don't just look like everybody. We, yeah. You know what I'm saying? We, we, we got a certain type of energy about ourselves mm -hmm. that we both Not bring. Great. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. It's like... We feed off each other and, and, and on top of it You feel me uh -huh. You feel me Not He got real. the ad list for you yeah. right there. So it's like you know, so What we bring What we bring I say is one, Everything Versatility uh -huh. Everything Versatility You feel me uh -huh. Second We bring our own type of Own type of flavor like, To everything You feel me Okay Like Y'all might got seasoning and y'all might got a whole lot going on over there, you know what I'm sure. saying? Like that bitch Sauce, got a whole lot that, going on. Yeah. Like, we got that flavor. You know okay. You know what I'm saying? We put it okay. we put it together a little different. You know what yeah. I'm saying? So you ask what's different, I mean hell, you really gotta ask everybody else type what make what make them different from y'all. Yeah. You feel me? I fuck with that. That's hard. So we try to stand out at the end of the day. Nah, know? it's a fact. And and it's like when you when you don't try and you just being yourself, that's what makes you stand out. Exactly. Not for real. Exactly. Yeah. You put you put it the right way. Mm -hmm. Not as right. So let the people know where they can find y'all at, where they can hear your music, all that shit. Oh, uh, find me Chuck it three times on Instagram. You can type in three times, same thing will pop up. You'll see it anywhere. Uh, YouTube Chuck it three times. All platforms Chuck it three times. Y'all know what is going on. Kareem the Dream, she loves Flacco. Y'all can find me on all platforms, YouTube, Instagram, all that. She loves Flacco. Y'all know. She loves Flacco. Nah, for real. That's a fact. And y'all heard it here first, man. Tap in. Murfreesboro on a fucking ride. Yeah, you already Murfreesboro, know. Murfreesboro, Tennessee. We yeah, over there. If you ever at, uh, y'all know where Studio 312 is at? It's a barbershop on Vine Street. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's where our headquarters is at. Where we record all this shit. Burrow? Yeah. Hey, on on Vine Street? In the yeah. 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 In the three, that's what it's called. Oh, it's called the three. Ah, we lit. <laughs> oh, we lit. Yeah, we lock in, lock in. We in the three. Yeah, that's what's up. Yeah, shout out my guy JD, JD Market. Y'all know what's up. Make sure y'all pull up. Cruise Control Radio. Come fuck with us.